Hello Facebook, hello. I'm here in the break room at work. Um, I know I had typed up my testimony and this had happened um, Monday. I was going home on my lunch break. As you know, I work at Myers, also UPS. But anyway, I was leaving at 10 o'clock in the morning going on my lunch break. But anyway, I was at the light and the light was red. All of a sudden, I saw a vision in the spirit realm coming from my left. A, a big mess hitting my vehicle, my SUV. And then I felt the spirit of danger come upon me. And I remember somebody else about a month ago, they were standing at the same particular light I was at. And the light was green and she went to leave. And then a big semi came out of nowhere and she was able to stop. Where in my case, I was in that same lane and I didn't go nowhere. The spirit of danger came over me. And I was not led to leave. And I told myself, I said, I'm not going nowhere. And the light was green. I said, I'm going to wait a couple of minutes. And out of nowhere, y'all, a semi came out of nowhere. Ran, ran the green light that I was supposed to take. And as the semi kept going, the guy had the nerve to look at me and kept driving. So to say all of this, new level, new devils. Okay? We have really got to pay attention of our surroundings. We must stay in the spirit realm at all times. We must get closer to God. We are living in the last evil days. This is the beginning of the end time movement. Satan ain't going to attack those that, that he got already. Satan is after the saints of God. Satan is after the saints of God. We have got to get closer to God. I ain't going to lie to y'all. It shook me up. And I'm still shaking. But I'm telling you right now. I'm doing a 40 day fast. Y'all can join me if you want to. I just shut everything down. I'm doing a 40 day fast. I'm praying. I'm going deeper. Amen. I'm going deeper. And I'm not just only thinking about myself. I'm also thinking about my kids. And things like that. So. It's really time to get deeper into the Lord. It's time to get in that word. It's time to pray. It's time to live a consecrated life. If we're going to make it. Because the devil is busy. And he don't care who he take out. When you got a high anointing on your life. And God has called you to do something. And, and Satan knows the anointing and the power that's on your life. But he don't care about that. Because he thinks that he is above that he think he got more power than what we have but he don't God has given us power over the serpents and the scorpions God has given us authority to come up against the enemy amen but we must stay deep in the word we must be filled with the Holy Spirit we must have the power of discernment and I know that we have busy lives and things like that and we get caught up in the things of this life and the spirit of distraction is high because there's so much going on and Satan is using that. He's using the spirit of distraction to try to draw everybody, including the saints of God, away from the presence of the Lord. Away from the word of God. Away from fasting. Away from praying. Anything that's going to connect us to God, he's trying to do everything he can to get us away from God. Right now, we cannot afford to be away from God. We need to get deeper in the Lord. Now, I'm saying this because I know I'm not the only one that is going through attacks. But this attack was high. Not saying that Satan ain't trying to take me out before, but this was big. This was big. This, this would have been fatal. You see what I'm saying? So anytime Satan is throwing an attack, especially different attacks that you have not experienced, look at the level that you are on in the Lord. And remember, new levels, new devils. Anytime you go higher in God, you've got to go deeper in God. To get more revelation, to get more discernment, to get more power, to get more things from the Lord. Amen? Because without God, we're not going to be able to make it. I don't care who you are, what you call yourself. It's time to get deeper in the Lord. If you don't have a personal relationship, it's time to get it. It's time to get it now. Satan don't care. If you think you're going to survive, and if you want to survive, you've got to have a personal relationship with God. That's it. 
That's it. You got to have a personal relationship with God. You can't go out here thinking you do what you want to do. You don't want to get caught wide open to the enemy for him to come in and do what he want to do to you. And I thank God for the Holy Spirit. And I thank God for the power of discernment. I thank God that I wasn't distracted. Amen. I thank God that I paid attention to the Holy Spirit. To what God had put on me. To allow me to not move. And I did not move. Because the spirit of danger came upon me. That was God. Put the danger upon me because he knew what the enemy was trying to do. Amen. And the enemy didn't win. Hallelujah. So Satan is stupid. Because he don't know me. Because all I'm going to do is do what I was taught to do. Get closer to God. Fast and pray. Whatever I'm going to do. I'm going to go deeper in God. All he's going to do is push me closer to God. Amen. That's all he's going to do. So anyway, I had to get on here. I felt the Spirit of the Lord on me at my desk. And I just wanted to share my testimony. And please, it's time to get deeper in the Lord. You are called by God. You are saved. You ain't got to be a minister. But if you gave your life to the Lord, it's time to get closer to the Lord. Seriously. It's time to get closer to the Lord. Amen. And y'all be blessed. Bye-bye.